but now the last year it's been good getting just kind of into the community, the fabric there. And uh, I got a job, part-time job at the homeless shelter, which is what I did most of my most of my life. And uh, it's good being back with people that totally look like me. <laughs> so right, so yeah. here. I can make a sandwich for anyone any time of the day. A sandwich? Absolutely. And I've also got a show on the radio. And there's radio people yeah. in there. And radio's fun. It really is fun. And I have it down at the Kootenai Co-op Radio Cooperative. And uh, right now I'm missing the funding drive, which I'm bummed because they use spring and fall is when the funding drives happen. And, uh, anyway, it's a great small station. It's, I love going there. It just feels so much cooler. And I know people, I don't know what that means anymore. Because there's people in the office here just hanging out in there. Hey, how's it going, Bob? Yeah. <laughs> awesome. Yeah. It's really awesome. And uh, I got the show, and I'm driving to my first show, and uh, I have to think of a name for the show. I don't, and I was like, I was listening to R.L. Burnside to an album called My Black Name A Ringin'. I didn't call my show that because that wouldn't make sense probably. Like, it might be offensive. I don't know. I'm not sure. But anyways, I called it my poor name of ringing. And my poor name ringing, which I said to my dad, he's like, what's it called again? And I'm like, well, you don't even listen. That's fine. You don't even play the part. <laughs> anyways, and so and then I have a theme song. I was thinking on the way to my show, what's going to be your theme song? And I knew right away when I was 14 years old what my theme song would be for my radio show at the age of 39. And uh, I remember getting this album by Public Enemy when I was 14 years old. <laughs> it was called Fear of a Black Planet. And it, I was like, holy moly. Like, holy moly. I'm 14 in a small town, white, pretty, really white. Really white guy. And uh, I just, oh, I held up to the, there's so many lyrics, look at that. That's a cassette. Like one of those where you get pulled out and you're like, holy crap, that's a lot. There's and this guy, Chuck D, he's the guy and he's so powerful. He just hits, drops it like a bomb. I, that's, I've heard that saying. That. Anyways, the song that I, that I chose was called Welcome to the Terror Dome. Welcome to the Terror Dome. That, I didn't even know what those things were. I, didn't, I had no idea, but I was just like, holy crap. And, uh, Start of the song comes in, and then, he, and then he comes in. He's all, "I got so much trouble on my mind. Refuse to lose. Here's your ticket. Here's the drummer get wicked." And I was like, "That's the baddest thing I've ever heard. That's the here's your ticket. Not even hey, can I get it? Here's your ticket. Here's the drummer get wicked." Down at the scene of the crime, they're working overtime. They're feeling the fire, beating the wire. What sounds like the choir is a house of liars. I'm still looking for a good and honest person for hire. Down by the riverside, do or die. Shopping carts, bottles. Passed around, open fire. Further up the Nile, there's the king of denial. Yeah, stop the trial. Who rock the boat? 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 Who rock
folks, stand up, stand up, stand your ground. Don't back down. Do not create no crown. No false story, no glory, no more children going hungry, no more banging on your knees, no more hope. please, please, please. No walls, no war, no more sand in the score, no more rich man favoring, never favoring the poor. Here comes the sunshine, Coca Cola, dark days are getting harder. They came for the people, now they come for the wall. Time is everything, it's the only thing. But the harvest brings the joy we sing. Who will rock the boat? 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 Who will rock the boat?